told you not to drop my camera. Hey guys, it's Katie and today I'm going to be filming a video that I never do. Um, I'm not going to be talking about makeup and stuff like that. I'm going to be talking about something really special to my heart. And I hope you guys keep on watching because I know you guys want to hear me talk about makeup and stuff. But um, if you stay tuned to the end of the video, you will see that I am having three giveaways. But in order to enter my giveaway, you will have to watch the whole entire video. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and I will... Just get, go ahead and get started. Okay, so today I'm gonna to be talking about something totally different than what I usually talk about. And I this is like my 700th time filming this video because I don't exactly know what I wanna say and stuff. So I have my laptop right here. So, cause I, in my notes I have everything that I wanna cover in this video. And I hope you guys bear with me cause I'm going to be looking at my computer a lot so that I have like a base of what I wanna say because I honestly don't know what I'm gonna say. Okay, so today I'm going to be talking about my amazing, amazing, kind, generous math teacher, Mrs. Mir. She is so kind and generous. She always thinks about others. You're probably wondering why I'm talking about her. And I'm talking about her because she sadly, sadly has a disease called ALS. And if you don't know what ALS is, you might know because of the ALS Ice Bucket Challenge. But basically, it is a very, very rare disease. Um that cannot be cured, but treatment and therapy can help slow it down. And in this disease, nerve cells break down, which reduces functionality in your muscles that they supply. And the cause is unknown, but um, the main sim symptom of this disease is muscle weakness. So that is the disease that my amazing math teacher has, sadly. Um, she is blessed to be a slower progression patient, but she has many, many expenses as her illness progresses, and I'll tell you about the main three. Um, the first one, she needs work in her house to accommodate a larger wheelchair. Sorry, I keep looking down. My computer's right there. But she needs work done in her house to accommodate a larger wheelchair, so once she needs a larger wheelchair, I will insert a picture of her and I right now. So she needs a larger wheelchair, and she also needs work done in her house. Why? Because her wheelchair, even right now, doesn't fit through her door. So when she does accommodate to get a larger one even, obviously it won't th fit through the door. And it must be hard because if she needs to go to the bathroom, her wheelchair doesn't fit through the door. So she needs her door frames to be widened and like worked on so that she can actually fit through the doors and stuff. And she also needs reliable transportation to transport her and her daughter places. She has a two-year-old adorable sweet daughter um and getting this van it will have a ramp in it so it's easy to transport her her daughter and her wheelchair places because currently she can't really go places because she needs her wheelchair and right now her wheelchair doesn't really fit through her car so she can't go places so those are the three things that um, my teacher needs currently but adding all that up it equals a hundred thousand dollars and I have a way of getting there so basically my friends my family and my amazing subscribers and supporters are going to help me get to a hundred thousand dollars to give to my amazing math teacher um, by donating money so I have two ways of donating money and there will be three prizes at the end for the people that do decide to donate um, it's not like, my family and friends aren't going to win these prizes. It's only going to be my subscribers for helping me get there. But I'm only going to be having the giveaway, um, the three giveaways, if I get to $100,000 um, for my amazing math teacher. But I have two ways of donating money. The first way is online. I have a really simple um, GoFundMe page, which will be on the screen right now and also down below in the description box. Um, that is a really simple way of donating money online. And also, if you would like to mail money, all you got to do... Just take a simple envelope. A simple envelope. A simple envelope. And take the amount of money that you want to donate. Even a dollar or two helps immensely. But obviously, you can definitely donate more money. Um, so all you got to do is take your money and obviously put it in the envelope. Super simple. 
And then you put this address, which is on the screen right now, and I will also put it in the description box down below. It is Kids Changing the World, 110 Chestnut Ridge Road, number 337, Montville, New Jersey, 07645. That is my P.O. box, so um, all the money that you're sending to this address will go to my P.O. box, and I will receive it. So those are the two main ways that you can donate money, and also the three giveaways that I'm having. One is makeup-related. One is Bath & Body Works related, and the other one, I'm giving away a Manny MUA Makeup Geek palette. If you don't know who Manny MUA is, you should, because he's amazing. And I'm going to be giving one of these away. This one is mine, and my mom also pre-ordered another one. We have it right now, and it hasn't even been taken out of the packaging, like the actual box that it came in. Um, so those are the three things that I'm going to be, well, the three main giveaways I'm having. Um, so, yeah, now I'm going to be reading a message that my math teacher actually, like, uh, wrote um so yeah stay tuned for the message because it's really amazing it's basically her ALS story since 2012 ALS has been weakening my body making everyday menial tasks difficult if not impossible a body that once taught fitness classes and completed triathlons is now confined to a wheelchair after eight years of coaching special olympics and 18 years of teaching middle school math I'm proficient at encouraging others when there is a challenge to overcome pushing myself is more difficult but I use the strength of my family friends students and those in similar situations to catapult me into another day being reliant on others needing so much help and fearing public places because I cannot not bring my wheelchair plague my every thought i am currently blessed to be considered a slower progressing patient the future is unknown i am however sure of my hopes dreams and prayers i wish to accompany my two-year-old daughter to the park zoo swimming lessons or her yearly doctor appointments i don't want to miss story time at the library because i cannot get there i'm still teaching i would love to continue to educate today's youth not just in mathematics but life i strive to be a model of strength and perseverance every day these are all essential. I know that's not what it says, but I don't really know how to pronounce this word, so essential is another like synonym. So these are all essential components to maintain my current life. My desire is strong. I just need a vehicle to get me there. You have no idea how grateful my family and I would be if we were selected as a recipient or receiver of a handicapped accessible vehicle. My young daughter, who just wishes for her mother to be with her, would beam with excitement if I could be present outside of the house. While I am on this earth, I have so much to offer. It is not the person you are when you fall that matters. It is who you are when you get up that can change the lives of others. Please provide me the opportunity to make a difference and leave my mark on this world. For your consideration, we are so thankful. So, basically, that's her story, her ALS story, and she comes to work every day, makes a difference in my life, my, her students' lives as well. Um, I bet we can make this go viral. We are kids, but we can definitely do it. So, I hope you guys all enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.